this tax season, expect surprises that could impact your wallet. Several tax breaks have changed and the IRS has announced new upgrades. Those changes include many pandemic era exemptions, which are now gone. ABC 3340's Bobby Portovan is working for you tonight after talking to a tax service in our area. Bobby, there's a certain group of people who are expected to be impacted more than others. Stephen, some of the biggest changes will actually impact parents and how much of a refund they'll get back. Parents who receive the child tax credit and the child and dependent care credit could see their refunds reduced as much as $6,000. These two tax credits are rolling back to pre-pandemic amounts. Susie Smith is the owner of SAS Tax and Accounting in Pelham. So folks may seem uh, to get a little less uh, refunds than they were getting in the last couple of years. But that's not the only credits going back to where it was before the pandemic. The American Rescue Plan put enhancements on the earned income credit, helping families get bigger refunds in recent years, but not anymore. In the 21 year, um, folks who did not have dependents um, with lower incomes um, may have been eligible to receive earned income credit. It's going to be a little harder to receive that without dependents in the 2022 filing seasons. There is good news. The IRS is now paying you more per mile if you drive your vehicle for work. They are also giving families impacted by the January 12th storms more time to file their taxes. For those folks impacted, businesses and individuals, um, they have a little extra time to file and pay their uh, taxes this year. It's till May 15th, and that's for filing and for paying their returns. Now for everyone else, the last day to file your taxes is April 18th. Stephen? Bobby, one question on many's mind will likely be how soon can they expect to get their refunds back if they have one? Stephen, that's really the million dollar question here, right? So the IRS says if everything goes smoothly with the process of your tax refund, you should get that refund in about 21 days or less. They actually say that most of the refunds, nine out of 10 of them actually receive those refunds or people receive those refunds within that time frame. Stephen? Bobby Portovit reporting.